this preliminary objection is accordingly also disallowed at this stage. Finally, honorable senators, ladies and gentlemen, is the matter of appearance of the deputy governor by honorable Silvanus Osoro, a member of parliament serving in the National Assembly, who is also the majority whip in the National Assembly. It recognized and is provided for in standing order 83 of the Senate standing orders that the governor has a right to appear and be represented before the Senate or a special committee. This is a right recognized in Article 50 of the Constitution. It is not in dispute that Honorable Osoro is a member of parliament and a state officer in terms of Article 260 of the Constitution. Pursuant to Article 751 of the Constitution, a state officer is required to behave, whether in public or official life, in private life, or in association with other persons, in a manner that avoids any conflict between personal interests and public or official duties, compromising any public or official interest in favor of a personal interest or demeaning the office that the officer holds. In this respect, therefore, it is also useful to cite the well-known principle that justice must not only be done, but should also be seen to be done. The attention of the Senate was drawn to the Senate, was drawn to the Senate, can properly take judicial notice of the fact that the Honorable Osoro is a member of parliament representing a constituency in Kisi County and a leader both in the county and the national level, holding a senior leadership position in parliament in the parliament of Kenya. And Article 93 of the Constitution, parliament consists of the National Assembly and the Senate. And although the National Assembly and the Senate are required to perform their respective functions in accordance with the Constitution, it is the role of parliament to protect the Constitution and promote democratic governance of the Republic. The roles of legislation